This video covers troubleshooting the ESP LXD controller going in and out of short finding mode while a program is running. If you notice that the ESP LXD alarm light is flashing as stations turn on and off while running a program, it may indicate multiple problems. A two-wire path issue, plus potential shorts downstream of a valve. Now in this example, the alarm light is on. If I press alarm, I see that I'm in short finding mode, which is causing the alarm. If I advance to the next station and the controller goes out of short finding mode, it probably means that I have shorts downstream of that particular decoder on the previous station. Run the decoder test to check for shorts downstream of the decoder. Another way to view what's going on is to turn the dial to test all stations, check systems, and select two wire diagnostics and then line survey. When we are in short finding mode, the line survey indicates current not okay and overload not okay. Another condition you might see if you're right on the edge, drawing high amps but not yet creating an overload condition, that would certainly indicate why the controller is going in and out of short finding mode. Now, when the controller entered short finding mode, when the current and overload were not okay, the program in the background was paused. And eventually in this condition, you may see the alarm light go away because the condition went away. In this case, we recommend turning the dial to the off position, which cancels the program that is currently running. Turn the dial back to test all stations, check system. Go back to two wire diagnostics and select the decoder test. For instructions on running the decoder test, go to video number four. Refer to the video ESP LXD using decoder test and ping decoders to troubleshoot valves for more information. Be sure to visit rainbird.com slash ESP LX series for product manuals and FAQs. You can also call us for free professional support for programming and troubleshooting.